Uh, it's Friday. It's uh, 3.08 p.m. in the Los Angeles time zone. I'm Michael Muss. And it's time to play some more Mafia Definitive Edition. This is my first time playing the game. Uh, from what I hear, I'm pretty far through. So this may be one of the last sessions I play it. But uh, happy Friday to you. Hope things are going well. The game itself is just absolutely killing it. It's a really great time. Hey, Pavel, Arthur, how you doing? Mafia Must is in the building. This is for sure. Hello, Queen. So, pick up right where I left off. This was after the Don asked me to go hunt down Frank, who is like his best friend from the war days. But he feels like Frank is going to expose the, the team. It's going to mess everything up. So, we're going to go mess him up. And you can see my main character there, Tommy Angelo. Tommy the Angel. It's been fun. Chenzo's waiting for you with a clean car. Okay, all right. Look at his suit. Look at the pinstripes. Look at him. Look at him. Okay. Uh, I'm going to take a quick... Saw Frank, there was no sign of this. We had a drink. Talk business. Not this. The Don is just kind of getting introspective here. Like, what's going on? Frank's selling out the gang. This is not going well. Who should get your money? Brewer or what does that say? Family? Vote dry. Huh. You're going to bring your money home to take care of your family or are you going to drink it all away? Ooh, that looks like a nice ride. Hopefully I'll get that. Busta. Tough day today, Tom. It is a weird day, ain't it? We got to keep a lid on this, Tom. Thank you. Start Thank you. Lift, but don't give him nothing. I got you a clean set of wheels. A clean set, set of wheels. Here, if you want it. I'll take it. What you got? Ooh, a sawed off. Sure. When Frank sees a Lapara, he'll know. The old ways work. All right. You got to get those books back before the feds use them against us. Okay, I'm going to take the car. I think it's this thing here. Although I kind of want that car. But whatever. I'll take it. <laughs> nope, this is not GTA. Entering a car is not triangle. And now for the latest news. The Navy is gonna tune in. continuing its search for the remains of those brave souls lost aboard the airship USS Akron. Akron was destroyed in a violent thunderstorm off the of New Jersey coast Tuesday hmm. morning with the loss of 73 of 76 aboard. The disaster stands as the worst aviation accident on record. Yesterday, one of the survivors, true. Lieutenant Commander Herbert B. Wiley, spoke to members of the press and gave a brief account of the tragedy. He also spoke of the hey, unknown. rescue by the German Baking tanker, some cookies. President Roosevelt Love it. described the loss of the Akron as a national disaster and said that he Everybody have a good Friday. the lives and families of those lost and the nation. We will bring you more on the disaster and the Navy's search as we receive it. Oops. Thank you for listening. We return now to our scheduled programming. I'll have to take a look, Arthur. I When I looked one time before, I couldn't find it, but maybe I just didn't look at the right menu. You would think it probably exists, right? I'll just park this right here. You boys watch this for me, okay? Ah, I'm stoked that it's the weekend. Next week's a short week. I got Friday off work next week for Good Friday. Thankfully, my job gives us about one day off per month, some way, somehow. Tommy, post oh, the rumpus. Biff. <laughs> Sir, you can't park here. Biff, we gotta have a serious conversation. Heard any big news lately? Something that Don might want to know. Uh, depends. <laughs> What's it worth to you? No Twenty snow bucks. on your lawn, How just crabs. All right, spill. The FBI's in town. 
They're getting something from Morello, but I, I don't know what. Oh, what oh queen? Little Tony got some guy drunk in the black cat and drove him home. Heard a bunch of stuff, so he's the guy you want to see. Okay. Thanks. Uh, yeah, Good Friday is celebrated right around Easter, I think. What is it? The day, the weekend before, the Friday before Easter? You don't work Fridays at all. Always Lucky a pleasure, dog. Tommy. All right, so now I gotta go find little Tony. Where's little Tony at? I needs him. I needs to speak with him. Oh, smart queen. Book the week off, and you don't work bank holidays. That's awesome. Oh, Thursdays when it starts. Cool. That might be right here. I don't know. It's a good question. I'm just driving like a crazy man. Don't mind me. Racing. So I have a question about a game. I'm trying to remember the name of it right now. Un... It's like a game based in Seattle. Just turned 10. I think today is its 10 year anniversary. Un... You're like a superhero. Kind of. Can't, I'll have to look it up, but I'm curious. I saw some gameplay today. It looks really fun. Especially for a 10 year old game. It's right on the tip of my head. Not like unfinished, untouchable, and something, something. I'm no good right now. I'll have to look it up. Oh, that's cool, noob. Where's little Tony? Hmm, is there anything to collect? Everything okay, Tom. Hang on, I gotta read the news. Go get them, boys. Game 7 of the 1933 Gold Series takes place today. The Lost Heaven Lancers play the Empire, Empire Bay Cannons at the Armory, with one team certain to take home the trophy. After a heroic campaign filled with exhilarating twists, Captain Bunny Smith will lead his men into the Diamond to play for the Lancers' first series victory in over two decades. All right, I got to talk to you real quick, but first I want to make sure I get everything that's in here. Terror Tales. Okay. Nah, Little Tony. Nah, it's not. What's this about the guy you drove home who's with the feds? He came in for a drink, which turned into ten. He's hired muscle for some kind of safe house. Where? Oak Hill, corner of Pine. He gave me ten bucks to drive him back and keep my mouth shut. <laughs> that on that council of Gilates brokered some kind of deal between Morello and the FBI. Uh -oh. They were all ready to sit tight on someone in there. Why the hell didn't you tell us? Tom, I did. I came in to see Frank straight away. He didn't tell the Don? No. Oh, no, he oh didn't. Frank's the guy. Tom, what's going on? I don't know, Tony, but I'm going to find out. Some people are going to get hoit. You know what? Will I get in a lot of trouble if I just take this person's car? Because this is cool. Easy, easy there. Bah. We return now to the coverage of Game 7 of the Gold Series. And by the looks of ah, here's what I was just reading about. We're gonna put him in some concrete shoes. Queen Tacy's got him on order. Whoops. Unleashed? No. This is this game? I'm gonna have to look it up. I think it's on PS Plus. 
whoa, 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 whoa. The other car was cooler, but this one looks nice. Well, the other one was a little quicker. A nice drive in the city. I wish Asset was here. He would know this game because we've talked about it before. There's two of them. Something, something, and then something, something, sun. I think it's un-something. I can't remember right now. I feel so dumb because I brought this up. I should have been the one to know the name of the game. Yep, same style as the Golden Gate. Wrong part of the country, but same style. I'm sure there were a lot of those kind of bridges, and maybe there still are. Golden Great Gate is definitely a classic. It's been there for a long time. Unstoppable? No. Unbreakable? No. I'm gonna have to look it up. Sorry, y'all. Let's put a pin in this conversation. I'll come back to it. Oh, what else happened? I got my taxes done yesterday. That went really well. It was nice. Our tax guy is a very friendly guy. He's very smart, knows what he's doing, so it feels good. Got to be careful nowadays. There's a lot of people out there that don't know what they're doing and can get you in trouble with the Internal Revenue Service. What else is on the radio? Camper's great. I'm going to take it out. We're going to take it for um, a little ride on Sunday. Probably have lunch in it. Just a little chill. And then I'm getting close. Like I'm about 15 days away from, no, maybe about 20 days away from camping in it. Let's see what happens here. Looks like the place. This is the place. Well, we're in the suburbs a little bit. Even with backup cameras, I still drive like this. Except for I'm a little bit better at it than he is. There's Frank. You busted. Sell out. He's still mad about his dog. That the Don drowned and then shot. Oh, okay. Tail Frank and his escort. I love how you can hear the, like the engine, at the exhaust Maybe system cooling down. Books, Frank. And we return now to cover what could be the final play of this game and the series. So I'm guessing I got to stay pretty far back. Oh, someone's running a lawnmower. Cigarettes and these teams could be said to be entering golden eras. Cola these infused with booger sugar. With promising youngsters set around them. I refer of so course to Smith and Seidel. The cannons have had several such golden periods. The Lancers, it's fair to say, have not. I can see Lancers manager Frankie Hodge prowling in front of the dugout, gesticulating. He seems animated to say the least. Looks like he's putting one of the officials in his place or something or other. With the noise of the crowd, it is quite hard to say for sure. Whatever's going on down there, you can feel the sense of occasion, and you just know that... I'm watching that meter at the top. The crowd will be the first Trying to stay back without... Has happened. Without getting too far behind. ...now within minutes of snatching the gold series, which at one stage had appeared doomed, but they equally teeter on the edge of defeat. It all comes down to the... Listening to a ball game, Nobody tailing some feds. What could be Nobody more Chicago? ...is considering the possibility of extra innings. Bunny Smith then standing on the mound, a look of steely determination on his face. He's betraying no emotion, doesn't look nervous or tired after his exertions this series, nor does he appear to be carrying the weight of expectations. Not too bad so He's far. I remember when GTA games were some kind of brutal with these tailing missions. Today, 
you get caught all the time. Welch is great. Noob, you were saying that well, you were saying that you live on a res. Could I ask um, if your Scoobies? You don't have to answer, but could I ask if your Scooby snacks are allowed? Do they like sell them there? Because you can buy those anywhere here, but I always wondered about that. Oh, a bird just hit my car. I feel like they're leading me on. Oh, cool, noob. That's good. They're not on to me yet. They got a little glimpse. Hey, Lancers win. I wish I bet. Lancers win, okay. Back to the smooth jazz. What else got? There we go. Now you know what? I want to clear my head. Turn the radio off. Gotta stay focused. On the road again. Going places that I've never been. <laughs> Go Lancers, whoever you are. I mean, I was a Lancers fan before they won, you know? Arthur, did you hear that they're replacing Logan Sargent? They're having... Alex Albin drive Logan Sargent's car tomorrow because Alex Albin crashed his car in practice. I don't know how I feel about that. This doesn't seem fair, but... Christ, they're flying him out of state or something. Fuck, this ain't good. Oh, okay, okay, so sometimes yes, sometimes no. All right, so park your car in a hidden location. Aren't they going to see me doing this? Oh, they noticed that. They noticed it. They noticed it. God, dumb. <laughs> I don't think this is what I was supposed to do. Okay. Hmm. I don't think that's what I was supposed to do. Am I supposed to just wait? Oh. <laughs> Oops. You're getting F1 memes because of us. It's because of us. Yeah, I don't know. It's a budget team, so they don't have a backup chassis. So they had to do something. And Logan didn't score any points last year, and Alex did. So I'm sure that's why they did it. But even Alex Albin was like, I would hate it if this happened to me. Um, that doesn't sound right, but thank you. I could be way off on the name. It's in Seattle. Play someone with superpowers of some kind. I haven't looked in much into it because I like to be surprised by games. And once this chapter's over, I'll go look for it. And we'll talk. Maybe I'm wrong with the with it beginning with you. I could be. I don't I don't honestly know. Like, could it be like, I don't know. I know that there's a sequel called Something Something Sun. So you're like Sun, like, a, you know, like your child. Like, un... Yeah, I don't know. I really don't know. But well, thank you for trying. Thank you for playing. 
Christ. They're flying him out of state or something. Fuck, this ain't good. Oh. Uh, I see, I see, I see. Infamous, thank you. It's not un, it's in. Infamous. I want to watch a trailer for that. <laughs> there he is. That's it. Were your ears ringing? Because I was talking about you. See what I can get here. Sneaky, sneaky. I'm just gonna start moving forward. I don't know what to do. Oh, oh. I forget how to jump. <laughs> Talking behind your back, punk. What you gonna do about it? Awesome unknown. Getting paid is important when you're working. Try going in the side door here. We're all clear. He's mine. He's some kind of gangster. Why the hell isn't he being flown out by the feds? I bend it. I ruined it. I ruined it. Internet says GTA 6 could be pushed back until 2026 due to production reportedly falling back. Huh. Well, that ain't good. All right, I gotta catch up to him. Put me over the fence, put me over the fence. Come on, bro. Oh, oh, this ain't it, this ain't it. What's this guy doing over here? Can I sneak by him? I can. They're all looking for me over there. I'm right here. Whoa, whoa, get down, bud. Get in the car. Oh, no. Okay, I gotta do this again. That's interesting. I said, I don't know what to think about it. It's normal for games to be delayed, right? And especially with the economy we're in, it's kind of weird. So, yeah, I could see that. I said in your shortest sentence possible, what do you think of Infamous? The game. It's its 10 year anniversary today, I think. I saw a little snippet of... of Gameplay that looked pretty fun, and a lot of people that were really, really stoked about it. I'm wondering, like, is this a game that I should be playing? How the hell am I gonna do this without getting caught? Going in through the front door is probably not going to work. So I'm going to go in this other way. Why don't we not have Zeppelins anymore? Well, they were just super dangerous, right? Ooh, Granadas. 
I, is Second Son the, the original one, or is there... I don't know, I don't know enough about the game. I, I barely could remember the name of the game earlier today. I feel like I should be using a gun at this scene. I need some health. I think I'm making it through. Oh, shit. Jesus. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Just run now, man. Run off, run off the pain. There's a Zeppelin. Oh, shit. here. Come on, let me over the fence. All I can say is good. Okay. It's not great, though. It's good, just not super great. I feel like I'm gonna run out of time here. Total badass in the game. That sounds like my style. I like that. Nope. Long damn way. Hmm. Sneaky. Doors open, okay. Let's see how this goes. Up pops penny loafers. Tom. Frank. The Don sent me. I figured as much. Mm hmm I'm sorry it had to be you, Tommy. Anything you want me to tell him? I wish it could have shaken that better, but Morello finally came after me. It's okay. 
You can come out. Oh, his family. Morello offered me a simple trade. The Don's account books for our lives and tickets out of this town. I said, is it a long game? You hand the books over, you It's 10 years old, so I'm guessing I'm it's kind of so quick. I'm not so stupid, Don. They're safe. Morello was waiting for this. It's a key to a box in the That's Grand weird. Imperial Bank downtown. I told Morello I'd hand it over after the plane was fueled and ready to go. His men were meant Shoot to him, it before we left. Sorry, buddy. I took care of him. Tell them to get on a plane. Go on march, Alice. Get aboard. Frank, you're coming with us. Not right now, honey. Just get buckled in. Probably not ever. Tommy and I, we have some serious Eight or nine hours? Discuss. Okay. But not Frank. Bad. Get on the plane, March. For Alice. For me. Get on the goddamn plane, please. Pop Pop says get on the plane. Get on the plane for Grandpa. Okay, Nana. been paid yet yeah now you've been paid twice you take the ladies wherever they want to go yes sir pop pops Thank about to get Tom. popped Christ Frank why didn't you ask us for help I'm I guess I just wanted out one way or the other I'm tired Tommy Tired of lying to my wife. Tired of checking under my car every time I take a Sunday drive. And tired of waiting for the dawn to put two in my temple. He's got a heart. He's got a lot of heart, that kid. He's a good boy. I would not step foot inside that plane. The, I mean, that's legit. That's probably a real plane model, but... Hmm. Pilot's bad guy, maybe? Or a fed? That thing looked like it was put together from, like, old farm sheet metal. This stone, it's got a heart inside. It's beaten. Oh, I love it. They kept me in the same car that I stole. Lovely. Fake Strauss. <laughs> I got some business at the bank. Watch out, lady. This is a setup. Hey, what's up? Where's the safety deposit boxes? With my colleague downstairs, sir. Thanks. Thanks a lot. I appreciate you. Uh, where's the downstairs? Scoping out the security. I could take that guy. <laughs> it's, it's full of realism. Except for the fact that you can get shot like eight times. But that's gaming. Beautiful day, huh? Uh-huh. Shut your mouth, cop. Nice and quiet down here. Perfect timing for some sort of... Out of trouble, I hope. Oh. Man, I have missed a lot of collectibles. Three out of ten. I thought I was doing good on that, I need too. to access the deposit boxes for Frank Coletti. Oh, yes, right. Mr. Let, let me in there. Angelo? Yeah, uh, this is yeah. this is a setup. Mr. Coletti said it might be you who came and to provide access. Please, follow me. It's a setup. Mm -mm -mm. I smell a trap.
Don't try anything funny. It's gonna be a note that says something like, too late. I got the books and covered my tracks. Salieri never asked any questions. In fact, apart from the funeral, I never heard him talk about Frank again. Mm. Okay. It wasn't a trap. Yet. We gotta boy in this place. Frank's house, maybe? Damn, look at that ride. Chromed out. You're making my boys twitchy, Marku. Sergio, when I just came by to pay respects, that's all. Known Frank a long time. Almost as long as you. He's a good man. Smart. Loyal. <laughs> Loyal to his wife. His kid above all else. There must be some kind of honor in that in you. Maybe. But I'm still looking at this headstone with his little girl's name on it. It's a hell of a thing. Maybe they faked a fire to make it look like they all died. Which would be kind of smart. Chapter complete. Got rid of the rat in the house. Took care of that. <laughs> the house. The house. The house is on fire. Burn, baby, burn. Okay. What's going to happen next? So now there's no rat. We're not in as much trouble as we were last episode. Visiting rich people. Hmm. Okay. Look at these houses. Big yards, white picket fences. It's the American dream, eh, Tommy? I suppose. Not for you? No, sir. I don't like being closer to the business. Don't let the flower beds and front porches fool you. There's more criminals out here than in the rest of the city combined. Are that why we're in the neighborhood? In a way. A bit Girl's of a social a call. Exactly. His payroll name of Watkins. Turns out he's old friends with Galati. The city councilor. The same. Morell let drop that we might have had something to do with the Galati boy's death. Now Watkins is loaded for bear, trying to do right by his buddy. Mm. Word is, he's striking gold with a few witnesses. You have Yeah, names? Buster. Yeah. <laughs> the Paulie and Sam are taking care of them. I'm putting you on a different part of the job. We need whatever Watkins has got on us. And where's he holding? A safe in his villa. <laughs> I'm no safe cracker. <laughs> Don't worry about that. We're taking you to meet Salvatore. He's fresh off the boat, but he knows how to pop open anything. Just get him into the villa, find the safe, and he'll do the rest. Okay. What kind of rumpus should I expect? Nothing you can't handle. Watkins is going to the theater, so the house should be empty except for a bit of muscle. The office is on the first floor, and our stoolie says the safe is in the wall. Once Salvatore has the safe open, grab all the evidence and get out. Dead him, boss? Fair enough. Yeah, that's our guy. Salvatore, tutto bene. Tutto si, bene. Grazie. Don Salieri. Good Got the little you. tool kit on his back. You know the job. Don't Where's Chrono? Down. This guy's wearing a uh, cross bag. Tommy. It's a cool guys do that. Bumping the Watkins. Don't kill him. It'll just bring down more heat. You got it, boss. All right, Buona boss. Fortuna, Buona fortuna. Tommy. Tommy Angelo. Piacere di di conoscerti. Meraviglioso. <laughs> Pi favori. Tommy looks cooler like in every scene. He's so proud of our guy. Get out of here. Parli almeno un po' di italiano. Il capo ti ha detto il piano. Uh, I don't speak Italian. Yeah, Italian's a beautiful language.
Yeah, this ought to be an easy job. Boss told me, uh, please, uh, uh, understand. Entriamo dal labirinto senza farci sentire né vedere. La casaforte è dietro un dipinto al primo piano. Dammi un po' di tempo e lascia fare tutto a me. Quella cassaforte avrà sicuramente un allarme. Uh, yeah. This is gonna be a long night for the both of us. Uh, yeah. Ah, Cristo Santo. Oh, this guy lives in a nice okay, neighborhood, you can see. Do what I do. Do not get caught. See, si. you gotta keep safe. Safe? See, si. uh, it's um, uh, my job. Apro Casa Forte. Open safe. Christ. There you go. We're learning. Okay. Radio. Let's listen to the radio. Excelente. Excelente. Music. Perfect for situations like this. Well, we can't talk. Let's jam. Hell of a view up here. Oh no. A volte questo paese è stupendo. How can I go on? Safe Cracker's got a, a cross bag, Chrono. Telling you, cool kids wear them. In German, saying yes twice means kiss my ass. <laughs> That's really funny. I love that. I'll remember that. We're working on it right now, Bruno. Over wall. Labirinto. Labirinto. Look at this place. To be a lawyer, huh? Oh, a maze. Oh, a labyrinth. Stay here while I take out the guards. That's one. I'm so glad I have a map. Which way is he facing? Oh, I got you, pal. Got you, sucker. The cool kids. They wear cross bags. The safe cracker's wearing one, and he's the coolest guy in the game so far. As far as I'm concerned, mainly because he's wearing a cross bag. Nope. Wrong. Or as Queen calls them, a bum bag. But I don't wear mine like that. Ever. Yeah, I'll take the shotgun. It's always helped me in the past. Put that in my pocket real quick. Don't ask any questions about where he hides the guns. Just like all games. Okay, so this guy's looking right at me. Let's watch him for a second. Creepy old man whistling. I'm gonna give you a night off for sure. You're getting it right now, dude. <laughs> yes, fanny pack. Sleep, sleep. Shh, shh, shh. Okay, okay. John, have you played Infamous's son? Infamous son, whatever it's called? Prison Pocket? <laughs> I actually like that the best. Is that what you call a fanny pack? I know when I was growing up, my parents said don't talk to people who wear fanny packs because they're drug dealers. Obviously, that's not true, but maybe it was like in the 70s or something, but 
Not today, Junior. All right, I'm gonna get out of this place. There we go. I saw on Twitter a little bit today that Infamous is 10 years old, I think today. And there was a little clip of gameplay and I'll admit I was intrigued. Oh shit, 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 shit. How many guards are up here? I was intrigued by it though, it looked honestly really good. And I only saw like a few minutes of it, but... Oh crap. Oh, okay, I got this guy. Easy, easy. Like There's more? I think that's it. Yeah, cross back, wearing it around your chest. But, yeah, wearing it around your waist would be a fanny pack. And I don't do that. I might do it if it was like a extreme situation, but... It's not something I would do normally. Oh, see, I don't know the slang. You gotta, you gotta clue me in here. You ready, um, Salvatore, whatever your name is, ready? No? Okay, we'll keep going. Who else is out here? Uh, there's one. Anybody else around? Shh. He's coming right for me. Down. Get down. Well, I'll have to, uh, look on Urban Dictionary to figure out what that word means later. Learn so much streaming. Some good, some bad, some cringe. Except for like when you want to smuggle things in, I guess? That's really kind of gross. Any South Park fans? Remember when Cartman did that? It was an old episode, but very funny. These guys all want a night off. No, that's all of them. That was totally off topic. Salvatore! <laughs> yeah. Where are you? We're clear. Come on, Salvatore. I, I see. I was asking where he puts his guns. Now I know. That's a Tommy gun. Uh, I think I had more shots in the shotgun. No, I didn't, but... Mm, I'm gonna stick with the shotgun. Looks like there's a collectible right here. Super science. Where the hell did he go? Shut up, wait, Tommy. <sighs> Guy's a pain in the ass. Forza, get it, come back. He's quick. A little cat burglar. See you now. Say un tipo tosto, eh? What? What? See, he's got the bag. I don't know if you can see it. It's kind of dark. All right, let's go. Come on.
c'è un'entrata. Open. Kick. Kick it. Kind of like Picker, are you? Seriously. I mean, I will, but. Look for a. Dipinto. A what? Dipinto? Um, a painting? Da Vinci? Caravaggio? Yeah, a painting. I capito. Painting? Not really, Chrono. Would I consider paint. myself political? No, not really. Okay. I would I say understand. that my limit for politics is very no local stuff. Off. And Guess even then, another one to check. I don't really believe in it very much. I think it's kind of like big business. It's hard for me to get fired up about it. It all seems kind of like theater. Here, Tommy. Empire Bay mob boss murdered. Spectacular pictures of vile kingpin's fiery end. Notorious racketeer Tommaso Morietti was killed outside his Empire Bay residence last Thursday afternoon, the sole victim of a car bomb undoubtedly planted by an underworld rival. Bay residents will hope that Moretti's death brings an end to the spate of gang violence that has rocked their city in recent months. Few will mourn his passing. More photographs on page two. Yeah, it's like business. It's just a huge business and, and you can't, ah, uh, there's just so many games. Nice rifle. There's another collectible here. Only no? ball behind here. Yes, yes, yes. Al procuratore piace la roba costosa. Repent. America will not fall into temptation. Prohibition must not be repealed. Do not get drunk on wine, which leads to debauchery. Instead, be filled with the spirit. I mean, yeah, sure. Whatever you say. Tommy's like a one-man army. I can't believe he was able to take all those dudes down. Wait, wait, wait. What's over? That's a door. Okay. Um, Chrono, my take on it, and I do have a family member again. who works in politics, is that if you're going to have a strong opinion about it, go out and join. Go become a politician. It's really the only way you can make a difference. Voting is important to me, too, but as far as, like being all fired up about everything, go be a politician then. I don't have time to argue. I don't want to talk about it necessarily. Maybe sometimes with my wife and stuff about like local Another politics, so but... Nah. It's always when I've like worked and I've been the manager of teams, those are some Not of my rules again. is that nobody talks at work. We don't... Here to hurt you. He said we're not here to hurt you. I punched her instinctively. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that. But I often say don't um, talk about politics or religion at work because they have no no space, no reason to be in the workplace. It just causes problems and it's personal beliefs. And I don't I can't hate somebody for their personal beliefs. There's someone in the there are other people in the house it's on the first floor i know that for sure <laughs> nap time okay i gotta be real careful here because i thought it was just gonna be us in the house i was told it would just be us is there a painting in here somewhere or maybe at the top of the stairs no nah, he said it was on the first floor we looked at that one. Hmm, what about this little one over here? That's not a painting. Oh, maybe in this back room. <laughs> this dude's like, what is wrong with this guy they paired me up with? Did I miss something in here? You're right. You're right. Chrono, it only brings on arguments, distractions. And I don't, I don't even find it interesting to talk about with people that I completely agree with because then it's just an echo chamber and you don't learn anything from that. I don't know. Some topics I might talk about, which are local for the most part, like gun control, 
taxes, um, how the government uses the local, like state government or city government uses our money. That stuff interests me because those things matter to me. But a lot of it is just garbage. I know that poor lady's gonna wake up like, oh, here we go. There's a room I didn't check. No, oh. it's not in the bathroom. Sorry, buddy. Give me one minute. I gotta take a dump. Is it this? No, oh, I've already seen all this stuff. You're right, Buster. That's another part of it I don't like. And to John's point, it brings out kind of the worst in people sometimes. Poor lady. We laid her right out. I guess we were wrong. It's not on the first floor. I'm going to the second floor. Yeah, it's not down here. All right. Start on one side. I had my taxes done yesterday. They owe you some money? Good, they owe me money too. And this year I learned a little bit about what happens when you make money other than just your job. So that was kind of cool. This has got to be it. Yeah, that's that's where a gangster would keep us already. You get a picture of a gangster protecting a lawyer's stash. This is my favorite song in the game. Love it. Love the saxophone. Uh oh, it's back up. Shit. Be quick, Salvatore. Pachanza, pachanza. Patience. It's like Arthur. You got it? Doesn't matter. Come on, we need to get out of here. Vai dietro, dietro. Okay, here we go. They gotta be upstairs. Shit. Ooh, that was so close. He like silenced his own thing. Salvatore, you crazy, dude? This room's not even finished. Hopefully Salvatore can't be killed, because I'm kind of just leaving him. I'm going through these rooms just to see how they're living. That's a dirty bathroom. Somebody was on their way out. Taking cover. About to take some shells. Oh yeah, guaranteed. That's why they have workers. That's why when I guess when you're this rich, you need to have this. Hmm. Where are they coming from? I'm just touring the house. Oh, this must be servants' quarters. I'm touring the house kind of for collectibles too, and to check out how they're living. Oh yeah, kids are dirt balls. Totally, I 100% agree with you. Look at that. Look at that. It's a nice model of like a. Somebody's here. Is the shotgun like silenced? What's going on here? It is not making any noise. Did I get out this way? Negative. 
Hey, that's one big bastard. I feel like all the gun sound effects are kind of messed up right now. They all sound silenced. There you go. Thank you, Arthur. Just like every day. Uh oh, Tommy gun. Just like every day, this channel is self supported by members and MrMichaelMust.com. said that. Let's go. Ah, oh, kids are so gross like that. I can imagine what a mess that was. Like, give me your gun. What's yours? Salvatore, stay back. I'll deal with him. Did you say Forza? Let's go. We're already in trouble. Just get in the car. This is called a bolt, so hopefully it'll be quick. They went the wrong way. All officers, search is called off. Repeat. Ah, grazie Dio. Salvatore, where do I take you now? Home. Yeah, where home? Uh, six and uh, Naipaul. Okay, let's go. Good. Mission accomplished. I don't want music right now. I'm too fired up. Tommy's driving all like leaking blood. Salvador's like, Ugh, I don't know where I live. Expect me to know these things? Cool driving billboard. Does anybody have them in their time? I see them pretty frequently in Vegas. They look a lot different now, but same concept. Truck with a big sign in the back. No big deal. The racetrack was a lot of fun. 
proud that I got through that the first try. There's a more, like, closer to simulation driving style that you can turn on that I'm sure makes that race a lot harder if it's anything like real life in these cars. Probably very unforgiving. Slippery. But it was fun. I enjoyed it. Still haven't ridden a motorcycle yet, though. I really want to. If those just end, be, end up being NPC bikes, um, not going to be happy. I'm not going to be real happy with that. Liz, say oh, happy Friday to you, too. The week is over. Weekend begins now. Tommy, devo dirti una cosa. Al nostro prossimo lavoro, penso io alla casa forte. Hai capito? Ci ho quasi rimesso la pelle in quella villa. Ed è tutta colpa tua. No, I don't say. Almeno un po' di italiano. Ehi, ehi, ehi. Il rispetto della nostra patria. Uh, è come parlare al mio cane, lo so, ma Cristo, dovevo dirlo. Non farlo mai più. Mai più. Ok, ok. Uh, ok, oh, sure. sure. Guess he wanted some music. I didn't catch that. Word. Busy week, Liz. All right. Yep. Bye. Bye bye. Chicago Drift. All right. Nice work, kid. Get out. Love your cross back. That was fun. Good chapter. Uh, it is in the 30s. Like That was like 1933. So it's during Prohibition. Visiting rich people was a good one. I'm going to watch the cutscene for this, and then I want to take a quick break to look at something real quick. Quick break to look at something real quick. You know what I mean. It's good. It's um. I think I'm getting towards the end. It's a great deal. 1933. This is the last of the good stuff, boss. I know. Some of those bottles I've had for ten years. But we got to make payroll. <laughs> Get it out of here. <laughs> Buster, right. thank you Hold for gifting up. a membership. Good to see you, boys. That's funny. Boss. Any word on a job I pulled with Salvatore? You did fine, Tom. Galati's got nothing on us now. We bought some time. At least until the money runs out. Don't go selling off the farm yet, boss. Oops. Sam says you worked out an angle. Yeah, and you're gonna love it. We make a few bucks and knock out a couple of Morello's teeth, too. Okay, what's the rumpus? A couple of weeks ago, I'm relaxing in the cigar lounge at the Blue Tropics. Love Where? Polly. He's it's great. a small-time whorehouse. It's just a couple of closets with some mattresses on the floor. It's a gentleman's club. They got a bar and everything. <laughs> it's a gentleman's club. They got a bar and everything. Anyways, one of the Johns is south. You and did, he's Buster. to the madam about all his troubles. And Nick, happy Friday to you, too. Of his goofy accent. He's going on and on about how he just landed this huge payday. But the goons he's working for are already twisting his arm. Oh, yeah, the pompadour and he's hairstyle. The nose to show for it. Classic you gangster. Pick up his Hell no. But I walked him out of the place, took him to the diner around the corner to sober up. We get to talking. Turns out his name is Gates. He's this hick up from Kentucky. Moonshiner? <laughs> uh uh uh. Better. His pop's got a couple of real distilleries, and I'll give you one guess as to their exclusive buyer around these parts Morello. And you think he wants to burn bridges? Oh, yeah. I've been working him steady, boss. He's bringing up another shipment tonight, but he's got his entire crew ready to roll over. All we gotta do is make it look like a proper heist. Okay. I don't know, Polly. You really trust this guy. He's got no love for Morello, I'll tell you that. Not like we got a lot of options here. Mm. We'll be cutting up the last bean pretty soon, boss. What do you think, Tom? So they're running out of we booze. We need to replace the Canadian. Yep, the if Canadian whiskey is can dry. It, I'm in. Where's the meat? The big parking garage downtown. Okay. Oh, perfect. Do Only it. one way in, you one way out. You'll be playing grab ass this time. You take Carlo and little Bill with you. 
sure thing. Awesome. Boss. Have, have fun with that, Liz. Drive that sounds like here. a great time. You'll have to tell me how long it takes in your area. It takes hours here to do that. Giving you some time out there in the streets with the guys, Carlo. You don't have to worry about me. I know I don't. Tommy does that for me. Okay, so we got a new guy helping us. All right, real quick, I just want to check this out. Let's see. Um, I'm gonna watch the trailer real quick. All right, let's look together, you and me. So this is the game I was talking about. I've never played it before, but here's the official trailer from 2013. It's 10 years old. Hang on, let me get this. Every lunch for the past. Oh, damn ads. Past two months. Skip. Sucker Punch. So it's made by the same people who made Ghost of Tsushima. Kind of excited already. I didn't know that. That's the Seattle Space Needle or Sky Needle. Should be 10 days, Liz. That's a federal thing. But I mean, it'll take hours of standing there waiting in line. That's what I. That's what happens here, at least. G7 status. I, I got this game in my library too. I, I, I don't know. B2 status. What should we do? B2 repeat status. On me. Keep your eyes peeled. The DDP is in control of the situation. Check in. B5. B5. Over there. Cover me. I want him alive. <laughs> no worries, Liz. Everybody waits 10 days. Oh, I could be wrong. Not against being wrong. Well, this looks... I mean, it hasn't really shown any gameplay yet, but this looks at least exciting. I have no idea what's going on, but... That's either our man or the villain. I don't know. You are not in control. Okay. That's not the villain. Now let's see some gameplay real quick. Gameplay spot. Rated T for T. Poor ADP. I'm like, why is this looking so weird? Touch me, I'm sick. Touch me, I'm sick by Mud Honey. Touch me, I'm sick. PlayStation. You played a tiny bit of the second one. Let's see if I can get little more gameplay. I don't want to spoil anything, but I'd like to see a little bit more because that's all just kind of fluff. No, no walkthroughs, no... Uh, maybe the E3 trailer? These are always kind of hit or miss. It's Sucker Punch though, that's Ghost of Tsushima, right? That's the same people who made Ghost, I think? Arresting your brother over and over and you over again. You think this again. is a joke? No, I is don't. Is this how you want to leave your mark on the world, huh? Yeah, that's a good sign. Now look, for all we know, we may be able to pass you through their security, you know, because you're not a normal viral terrorist. He seems like a... Hang of your, uh, 
new symptoms. This guy right. seems like a bioterrorist. Of course, the only downside being that, uh... Nope, can't think of anything. This is pretty freaking awesome. Okay, that looks fun. I got this whole thing figured out. We hit the town, maybe swing by the Space Needle, always wanted to see it, and then we're back home to save some lives. I've been to the Space Needle. We realize when we hit the town, there's a fair chance the town's gonna, you know, hit back. Oh, and it's got Nirvana in, in the uh, soundtrack, or a cover of a Nirvana song. Hmm. Well, I mean, I do own it, so maybe that might be one to play. Uh, Chrono, your last stream, someone was asking if RDR2 was good, so I did a whole breakdown, and I said it's amazing, you need to try it, and he was astonished by the graphics and gameplay and all the detail. That's fun, isn't it? It's fun showing someone else, like showing someone else how good that game actually is. It is so damn good. I've never played a game that's so good. I've played some real good games, but never one quite so good. Snow Runner. All right, let's make time for it. Probably going to have to do it. I don't know. We're, you and I and Pavel are similar in time zones, so we're just going to have to find a day Every to do safe it. safe bus. One of Fortuna boys. Sam and little Bill said to meet him downtown. All right, Polly. Uh, Asset and I have talked about it before. He said it was good. He didn't say great or anything. Have you played it, Enigma? You okay, Carlo? You look kind of like you shake yourself. Ah, uh, <laughs> get bent. Big moment, huh? Finally running with the pack. Listen. I've oh, yeah, and Stephanie's in, too. That's right. I forgot she has it. Sure. Sure. Sat out on the road, wait until he's finished with his broad. <laughs> If you don't want me to come, I won't. It's fine. The boss doesn't have to know. Nah, you're coming. The boss <laughs> said you're coming. Nah, you're coming. You had a face like you're being taken for an airing. I don't want Gates thinking we're frails. Why is Gates sell on Morello anyways? First okay, time cool. Gates Enigma, it sounds like Morello it's not much longer than that. I think Asset said it, for him it was like eight. Is part of their so for me, it might be a little There's longer no depending on how the game goes, but... Why we're pretending to stick I'll put that one on the list. Maybe it's maybe it's something I could play. Seems fun to play right now because it's the 10 year anniversary of it. So oh, that's what got me thinking about it. Saw it on Twitter today. This plan is some bullshit, Tom. Polly told it to me yesterday. I know music. I gotta listen. Hey, when you get a lead for the boss and you don't just drive him places, then. Then you get to pick holes. So then, shut your damn mouth. Ah, whatever helps you sleep. One mm, that sounds good. Out, don't come nope. crying to me. You serious? You actually serious? Fellas, knock it off. Christ. Christ. Have one for me too. I can't have chocolate but it does sound delicious. I might make an exception for one of Noob's cookies. As long as it's never been in his prison pocket. Hey, using new slang. Beautiful city on a nice summer day. Gonna go cause some troubles. Little dance hall. I bet you would skip driving. This game is super, super quick. There's an option where you can turn off driving, like where you can just say, take me there, I guess.
I can't, uh, I can't have anything with caffeine in it. And I'm, I haven't had caffeine in so long that even stuff like chocolate that has a little bit of caffeine in it messes me up. It makes me so I can't sleep. And then I can't sleep, so I get a migraine headache. And it's not like the kind of headache where you're like, oh, I have a headache. It's annoying. It's like the kind of headache where I, I get of deals here. really, Walker really sick. Don't ask for much dough. Always closes up shop till I'm done. Okay. Evan, good. doing good. How are you? Gates is waiting up on the top floor. Like, I get migraine headaches to the point where I have to be in a dark room. I probably will throw up. And it's just like a level 10 pain. Now it makes every other pain in the world not that bad. Like I have a high threshold for pain because I've been getting them since I was about six years old, probably it six or eight. Clear so far. Only people with cars are people with jobs. So no coffee. Nine to five, place is deserted. No caffeinated well, we soda. No here. caffeinated tea. That kind of a job, sure. Let me tell you what, it's pretty exciting. All right, there's a pickup right there. Awesome, Anything Evan. I appreciate you, yeah, you coming, man. Only that he's got a bust up nose and crates full of the good stuff. Uh, Glad to have you, and I agree. It is pretty chill. Guy. I don't go for any of the gimmicks. I just like playing. Park up over there. Park up. I like good games, good people, food, movies, that kind of stuff. Oh, I parked him on the spot. What's up, Street Combat? How you doing? Happy Friday. Holly. Good to see you, pal. Yeah. Why's he, he got a broken gates. nose? Well, I hope you all have good taste in whiskey. Oh, really so the game could here. take 20 hours? Sorry. All right. Have a sip of that good old whiskey. Oh, yeah. It's fine. I guess it's Kentucky, so it'd probably be bourbon. If the Don's impressed, he'll finance more rents. And each one's gonna be bigger than the last. We're all gonna be rich, boys. Well, we are always happy to do business with good folks like Don Salieri. Please. Yep, none Give of that stuff. And yeah, chocolate sure does thing. have caffeine in it. Now we just gotta conclude this transaction. Like even a decaffeinated coffee has a few milligrams of caffeine in it. I can't do it. Okay. <laughs> I'll oh, take a glass of whiskey. What? I told you we gotta make it look like a proper robbery. Damn thing gonna be <laughs> crooked by the time I'm done with this city. Nah, don't worry, pal. With all the dough you're raking in, you're gonna be able to pay for a new one. <laughs> uh oh. Bust. Uh oh, not not the whiskey. Okay, let's go. Headshot. That guy's mad because I shot him in the junk. Forty five slug blown at you. Go. We're done here. Everybody okay? How the hell do they know about this? Because you always shoot your mouth off. Gates took a bullet. Good on you, Evan. Stay at it. Gates, you okay? This ain't as bad as it looks. Now take the booze and get. My guys will come for me. Now go, go, go. So long as you guys clear them out up ahead. Yeah. I'll with the Chrono, guy. I love I stuff like that too. You know you stand. I mean, like, I'll t I would love to have a good glass of Dr. Pepper or um, a cup of coffee would be nice. I do miss that a lot. No, 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 I want this. Okay, I'm supposed to take the car, I think. Come on, get in the car. What the hell? Wait, wait, wait. Okay, I'm supposed to ride along. I see. We got more of them. Some new car is running them. They keep coming. They're in my sights. Uh 
Oh, I snatched him a little bit. That's called peppering. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that didn't really work. You're right. Yeah, Chrono. I think caffeine is one of those things. I don't... It took me a while to get used to it, especially waking up in the morning and going to work, but... Then I started going to work and looking around being like, you guys are all high on coffee right now. You don't know. Like most people don't realize they're getting a buzz in the morning. I'm not preaching. If you drink coffee, I'm, I'm not, you know, I'm not saying it's a bad thing. It's just one of those things. Damn. Let's try this again. Get my head together a little bit here. Oh, whoa. Whoa, that was quick. That must have been damn near a headshot. There's health right there, so I'm gonna try and... Whoa, whoa, whoa. I feel like I'm missing somebody here. Okay, that's my chance at some health. Come on, get through, get through, get through. Headshot. Get these Tommy guns. Oh, I got lots of ammo. Yes. do that the truck can't get through this we gotta put it out look for extinguishers or something got you fire sprinklers up on the ceiling we need to turn them on okay okay whoa I sneak by this stuff Ugh. That's death. I'm working on it, bro. I'm looking. I'm looking. I'm looking. I got a truck full of liquor. Here we go. Can't drive through that. No, nope. can't. Can't drive through that. Maintenance room personnel. next. Who else wants to sleep with a few holes in your chest? Alright, before I save this stuff, I'm gonna look around. Look like there's some here. It's a thing. It is a thing. Oh, thank you, Buster. Thanks for answering that question. Yeah, Friday and Saturdays are pretty just chill, like random games that I, I want to play or that Many times people in chat recommend that kind of thing. That was intense. Don't feel flames on my face. Felt those flames on my face. 
I got two grenades. I'm gonna use those. Guy with a pistol. There we go. Headshot. You too. Coming for you. Oh. Come on. Pop up. Pop up. All right, I can't wait on you. Nice. I didn't do that, but that's good. So we got for ammo. Oh shit. Lots of guys on the streets. That's awesome, Chrono and Street Combat. I mean I like working hard because the time goes by quick, but honestly, if you can work hard and not have somebody on your ass all the time, that's also very nice. Ideal, even. You could even say it's ideal. I don't need any of this garbage. I know. No respect. Aha, uh -huh, this is where I wanted to be. In here, I saw it. Well, the man's down. There's a collectible here, though. Stay where you are. Don't move. So, combat, you're like an octopus. Many arms. What am I supposed to do? Get in? What do you want me to do? Grab a set of wheels and watch there we go. My back. Sure Got you. <laughs> Bolly, he's so crazy. What a lunatic. How the hell did Morello hear about my deal? All kinds of beavers in this city. We're yep. Out. Let's get the booze back to the warehouse and try not to In die. broad daylight, no less. Just running booze through the streets of Chicago in broad daylight. I knew it! We got more guys on us! Okay, let's slow them down some. Hit them where it hurts! I love this unlimited ammo. Gotcha. That one too. Morello sent more guys after us. I got him. Another motor coming after the bull's truck. This is cool. This also feels like uncharted a bit when you're driving the Jeep through like the camera where it was like Nepal or Madagascar or something. Leslie! Happy Friday, buddy. No, I'm just doing gangster stuff with my gangster friends. How's your Friday? Ready for the weekend? F 
fantastic. Oh, that's a perfect answer. Thank Christ for that. Let's Thank Christ for that. See what we got. We're going we got home now. I mean, I know it didn't go to plan, but we got the booze. Got the booze. Yeah. So tonight, me and you are going to drink a bunch of it. I guess we are <laughs> Street. <laughs> Unlimited ammo is what I can never get enough of. Fair. I kind of like Polly more because he's been in it, in the storyline a little bit more, and he's funny. Sam's cool, but he's like quiet. Morell's boys caught up with you. Yeah, boss. We took care of it. Oh, you getting a solid six? That sucks. Uh, he took a slug to the shoulder, but uh, he's a Let's hope blocker. it's two. Let's hope they're wrong. Here they're talking about it raining on Sunday. And we're supposed to be playing in a disc golf tournament, so we'll my, my brother and I. see if this hooch was worth all the trouble. Weather might just screw everyone this weekend. Yeah, let that sweet Kentucky bourbon hit your lips. It's so good when it hits your lips. Excellent. I'll work out the details with Papa Gates. The Don's like, once we're running this Kentucky brown, we'll be That's the Cavassier. Good work, son. I'm proud of you. I'm proud of all of you. Saludo. 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 I have not. I, I looked through the, your collection of beers, and I don't think we get any of those here. Not that I, not that I've seen. Maybe rarely, or maybe at specialty shops. It was a great deal, but the chapter's complete. <laughs> Intermezzo. 1938. So now we're going back Sounds to the like narration part of the story. Move. Waking up to it, maybe. But then prohibition ended. And a bootlegging business got knocked on its ass. You know, that fighting over booze, man, next to nothing. Nothing. It took us a few years to recover. But when we did bounce back, boy, it was something. We took what dough we had from the moonshine and Canadian whiskey and invested it into no records. Some of them even legal. Construction, restaurants, trucking, gambling. We branched out into everything except peddling dope. And by 35, things were looking up. We had good money rolling in on the regular. I had a wife and daughter. Sam was running a club for the Don. Even Polly had a few records of his own. Wasn't exactly happy, but uh, what do you call it then? Uh, content. Yeah, that was it. And Celieri, he finally starts talking about getting out of Morello's shadow. Maybe okay. buying our own cops, our own politicians. Hmm. That's interesting. You think Celieri was sourcing high binders in 34? Maybe. Wait. Well, a few years back, the voice squad got a judge on solicitation of a minor. Once in the box, he started confessing all sorts of misbehaving, trying to get a deal. But he copped to taking kickbacks from Rollo and your man Salieri. Playing him off on another, trying to goose the take. But once Morello found out, he threatened to bury the judge's kids on the beach. Still breathing, of course. Christ. Jeez. It was a missing piece. How was that? Morello was always winding us up, but he never did anything that might start an all-out war. Learning Celieri was building his own bench must have finally tipped his scales, because in 35, he hit us with both barrels. Huh. Chrono, you knew I would like Polly. Yeah, I think the game makes you like him. He's a good character. He's like a classic gangster archetype, kind of crazy and funny. Sort of reminds me of Pesci's character in Goodfellas a little bit, but more funny. Bon Appetit, or as I like to say, Bon Apple Tea. Hey, Tommy. Oh, hey, Tommy. What's going on? I'm glad you're here. <laughs> hey, good to... I'm going to Pepe's for lunch, but Carlo called in sick. You up for a drive? Sure, boss. Bravo. I'm already starving. You got a piece on you? Yeah. Need a piece you for lunch? Eh, uh, you know how it is. Things with Morello have been a little quiet lately. Maybe it's just got me jumpy, is all. <laughs> there are neighbors in the city, but I don't want to Ooh, this is a nice one. What do we make of this? What are you? Some sort of rolls? What I forget what the winged thing on the front is. 
Studebaker, maybe? I can't remember. Merc? No, not Merc. Whoa, whoa. Whoa. So how's Dra business, Tom? Hey, you know how it is. It's good. Sure, see I know it looks like him. I see the books every day. But since... Voice person. Happened, ...happened, I know that a capo needs to talk to his soldiers without some other guy getting in the way. You think I'm gonna need the peace, boss? Oh, yeah. It is a little sloppy. Sort of but I like dealing with all these big shots we got on the pad. Anything's better than those grifters trying to shift their hooch before the 21st went through. Ah, this is only the start of it, Tom. I got plans. Plenty of good people lining up for a slice. Glad to hear it. Hey, Morgan? I don't know. I don't know what kind of car it is. Hey, Luigi. I recognize that that is like a classic car symbol, but I don't, I don't know what it is off the top of my head, and that's not my era of cars. Oh, I just cop right there. Must be nice for you. Sometime Watch out. away from Polly and his cockamamie schemes. Well, that's been a conversation, boss. I'll give you that. <laughs> sure I am. <laughs> Me, Sam, and Polly, though, we're, from, we're still real tight. We've been through some times together. Yeah, the one I know. Next, some more of the day's favorite music. Yep, it's driving with the boss. Maybe later we pick up some goils. Chinatown is our stomping ground, I guess. It's funny because in New York City, Little Italy and Chinatown are right next to each other too, if I remember correctly. It's been a while since I've been, but I'm pretty sure they basically intersect. I wonder if most cities are like that. Or U.S. cities. I don't think we really have a Little Italy. We have a little everything in L.A., but I don't know of a Little Italy. We have a Chinatown. We have little everything else. Little Armenia, little Ethiopia, all sorts of different neighborhoods, but I don't know where Little Italy would, would be. <laughs> Get the Goyles! <laughs> it's one of my favorite, like, Chicago or New York, I don't know what accent that is, I guess it's probably Chicago, gangster, old gangster talk, reminds me of, like, Looney Tunes. Yeah, pushing those white walls. Oh, Colonel, I hope this is the beginning of a joke. What happened to Luigi? No say. I don't know. Right. Although I think More the car wire, changed please, slightly. <laughs> You're going to love this wine. It's a. Don't so yeri. Welcome, my friend. Welcome. <laughs> Good to see you, Pepe. Yes. Hey, come. Our guest has arrived, eh? What's on the menu today? My mother. She would be so honored if you tried her caponada. Excellent. Bravo, bravo. Caponada. Oh, let me get you a chair for you, huh? See, please. And to drink a Chianti. I've been saving this just for you. Yeah, bene, bene, bene. Okay. Chianti seems like the most generic huh? Italian wine you could possibly serve uh, the Don. But all right, enjoy, what do I know? Huh? Back at that time, maybe wine was hard to get because of prohibition. I'm glad you're off the Italian wine time. specifically. Uh, Sarah threatened to leave me if I didn't dry out. Nice, Pablo. I know. She told you. No. I put her up to it. Hey, yo. Drunkards get sloppy, Tom. I didn't want you to make a mistake we couldn't live with. Me too. This is fun, Arthur. Great game. <laughs> uh, for you? 
I can do for you? <laughs> Peppy, the meal is a masterpiece as always. <laughs> Molto grazie, Don Salieri. Praise from such a gourmet as you, it filled me with a joy. Uh, you wouldn't call me a gourmet if you knew what I had for supper. <laughs> oh, right, row. Those guys got Tommy guns. Get down! Always go with the bulletproof table. Damn. The old what Thompson. The Bro, you better Bastard could have at least let me finish my wine. Hey Salieri! Come out of there and we'll make this quick. Smoke him out, Joe. Throw it back. Shit, watch out! Concussion from a grenade like that would deafen you. You wouldn't be hearing anything. Probably would may kill you at that range anyway, even if even if the blast didn't get you. Going out the front door. Can you move? Not fast enough. Yeah, the OG. We're gonna ambush these boys. Yeah, I get to fight alongside the Don. Yes, I'll let's see how he shoots. While you slip out the back and circle around. You Are you kidding? Me? Blow them all down, Tommy. Not one of them goes home tonight. Oh, the angry bear. Be Come. Just be quick about it. Okay. Take that off you real quick. We get some health, some ammo. Oh, that was clearly a headshot. Taking cover from. Gotcha. You ain't got me. There you go. They like that in your tum tum tummy. All right, I'm out of this, so I need to take a shotgun. Or is it? Shot. I'm almost dead. Straight combat. This is your your way of dealing with stress at work. I like it. Oof. Not doing good. Where is this? Can I go through the window? Oh, got the collectible. Tommy, hang out, buddy. Hang out. We're gonna get this together. Yeah. No Salieri! Boss! It's clear! Oh, 
Oh, look at the balls on this kid. You really <laughs> saved my ass, Tom. We gotta go, my pleasure. The cops will be here soon. I need a minute to catch my breath. That's kind of nice to let me grab that collectible through the, the window. No, not the bar. We're going to see Carlo. That son of a bitch knew where I was going today, and he calls in sick. He set you up. <sighs> to us, Tom, you could have ended up just as dead. Yeah, I know, boss. Carlo's stacked up with some Damon Holbrook. Let's go see what he has to say about all this. Hey, sometimes you got to handle business, st Street. Sounds like the right thing to do. Step on it, Tom. Every minute Carlo's still breathing is a minute that's got me pissed. Sure, yeah. boss. I like the Don a lot. He's cool. The brass balls to wreck my car. Had to be Carlo, didn't it? His pop was tight with Morello right when we started out. Apple don't fall far from the tree, huh? Yeah, that restaurant's out of business I now. That is funeral. That is sons of be laughing loud. His mom's already a widow, Tom, and now he's gonna make her lonely till the day she dies. For what? <laughs> Some dough to buy his dope? Arthur, you no longer need to his face. <laughs> you no longer need your reservation. Got it. No what? Hopefully I'm mama glad. wasn't in the I'm kitchen. This happened. I get to plug another rat, and we finally go to the mattresses with Morello. Today's the day the damn breaks. Sure Today's the like day the damn breaks. Love it. Love it. You I like the intensity of Don's you got. Give him a place in your family. You give him respect. And this. This is how he repays you? If he's done this, what else has he squealed on? The farm, Makes sense. The bed and house, That's why they the have you managing the people garage. probably combat. Any of them could have been him. Yeah, so Jesus Christ, there's been a rat the whole time. For years. Yeah. The time we work it out is when his guys come this close to bumping me off. You ever see me whack a guy, Tom? It don't happen much, so you know I'm gonna make it special. Ooh, special whacking a guy? Whatever you say, boss. However you want to do it, it's fine. All right, let's go. I'll follow you. Show me where to go, big guy. He's agile. Why you let me go first, huh? Carlo might be waiting for us. No, Tom, my face is going to be the first and last thing this bastard sees. Yeah. Oh, the oh they must you be wrestling. Damn dirty grifter. You better dangle, sweetheart. It's gonna be a closed casket, Carlo. Yeah, Don. And in the jewels. You okay, bus? Oh yeah, just a little one. Let me catch my breath. I know exactly how that goes, Street. He's fast for a big guy. Don't let him get away! A little chase. Okay. I got it. I like the chase mechanics in this game. It's fun. Come back here, Carlo! Good job, boys. Yep, I'm going to. Hey, we ain't finished with you. Tommy, please. I can explain. Think about this, Tom. Please. Uh, we did think about it. We actually planned this entire thing on the ride over here. I can explain everything. Tommy, you gotta know. Bro, he was gonna kill Mom. I had to do it. I had to. They made me do it, Tommy. Whacked him. Is he still alive? I'm not sure. <laughs> yeah. Stomped. Mm, Sicilian music. It was so upbeat and kind of silly, but now it's pretty serious. It's a good thing that laundry's hanging there. Pretty ugly mess, I'm sure. Now we're sure. Now we're sure we're certain that he's dead. That was badass. Hey, Sergio, how are you? Keeping out of trouble? Sure. Who's this? Wait a minute. Is that Gordy? It is. Hey, Gordy, how you doing, buddy? Hotly recognized you. Jeez. What'd he do? <laughs> You said you were having some trouble down at the docks, right? Yeah. 
There's nothing I can't handle. Yeah, well, he did some risking around. This asshole was planning a strike. Strikes are no good for business. Yeah, Unless not good for your business. For <laughs> right. So I decided the union needed a little change in leadership. Is that all right with you? Of course. Yeah. Now. I hear something in the background. What, what that, is that uh, noise? Other thing. That's why I'm here. Salieri's still alive. We effed up, boss. God damn it! What happened? I don't know yet. Crew we sent is dead. Restaurants all shot to hell. Stop your crying. Can't have a conversation here. What about uh, the cockroach Carlo? Found him with his head smashed in like a fucking watermelon. Never seen anything like it. <laughs> Heat's coming. So must have figured Carlo was there. Get yeah. ready, Morello. Damn it. Even hear myself think. It's gonna be a war. I told you to shut the fuck up. Very gangster. We've been at war since. That's how you deal with all your problems, huh? It's just out in the open now. What do you want me to do? Make your rounds. Tell little boys to keep their eyes peeled and the powder dry. Okay. Put the word out. Hey. Just uh, keep your head down, little brother. You too, Don Morello. Mustache guy's next. We're gonna take him out. We got to. Trophy earned the day the war began. Chapter complete. Bon appetit. That was fun. Chapter complete. Bon appetit. Move your feet. Lose your seat. I want to see what this next cutscene is. But then I'm going to ask you all to meet me here tomorrow at 7. 14 hours from now. Trophies are just coming. I love it. I'm enjoying it. Happy birthday. We're at the start of something. I think I should. Something big. You think? Morello tried to kill the Don. Not Tommy, not Polly, not anyone regular. The Don. Oh, it's gonna be war. I'm ready for him. I hope so. I'm afraid of missing a um, cutscene here, so I'm gonna just walk upstairs and talk to the Don real quick. Hey, you need it up the stairs. I'll go straight up. It's war to them. <laughs> oh, today, yeah, there was a big shootout, war. noob. They tried to kill the Don. So I killed all of them, me and the Don together. It was pretty fun. And then they, I think the gunshots you might have heard, he shot the guy that he was beating. Um, Morello shot the guy he was beating up. That's probably what you heard. Hey, what are you doing carrying around a Tommy in here? Haven't seen any trouble just yet. Back to the old meeting room. Where you at, Don? Upstairs? I should have known. Mm. Hey man, I've been haven't been in here in a while. Where are the stairs? Oh, I see them on the map. Keeping out of trouble, do, 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 do. Always keep it in our trouble. Lookouts round the clock. Here, the warehouse, and all our businesses. How about people under our protection? Forget about them. We stick to our own till this. Okay, let's watch this. Our guys in. It's a nice shot. Good. We're finally going after her. Soon. But first, we have to soften them up. morell has got the cops, the politicians, and even some judges in his pocket. We can't afford to bite them all off. So we need to scare them into abandoning Morella's sinking ship. We bump off the right idiot, the rest are going to realize sticking with Morello ain't too good for their health. Hey, oh. First in line for the pine box is this asshole. Oh, cool. That's like we're planning the a heist. are still seeing red over his dead kid, so he's never going to turn on Morello. Christ, that guy's been giving us fits since 32. Let me take care of him, boss. Why do you think you're here? Then he's got it all figured out. The counselor is celebrating his birthday with a big shindig on a steamboat. 
Well, you know I'm good at steamboat missions. Broads, fireworks. He's even given a speech to the press. What kind of security? Just in normal detail, a few guys with Roscoe's. None of the other fellows are gonna do dick to protect that piece of shit. Okay, <laughs> I'll talk my Great way to the line. party, put two in his head. Slow down, Junior. Galati's corrupt, but he ain't stupid. His crew be searching everyone who comes on board, so you can't be carried. I've been patted down before, so, we can do this. What? Uh, throw him overboard, see if he can swim. Don't go getting creative on shoes. Me. You're still going to shoot him, for fuck's sake. Get on deck, you make for the head. We got a janitor on the take, and he's planted a revolver in the bathroom. Yes, poker and on you the just steam cool boat. Your heels. Exactly. Mingle. Try not to look like a hatchet man until Galati makes his appearance. You wait for that bastard to start his speech, and only then do you put one between his eyes. Between the, one the eyes. To get people talking. Sure. But you got a plan for getting back to shore. Swim. Sam and Paulie are down the docks working on that. You meet up with him there. And I'll fill you in on the rest of the details. Okay. To the bar, senor. The lot is done, boss. Great scene. You won't have to worry about him after tonight. I don't doubt it, Tommy. Born a fortuna, Tom. Good fortune, Tom. You got this. All right, I feel comfortable leaving it here. Thanks, everybody. It's been real fun. Buster, if you're still in the room, thank you for that uh, gifted membership. I really appreciate those. Helps grow the channel. If it's your first time here or if you're watching this later now's a perfect time to subscribe you all know i stream monday wednesday fridays and then saturday mornings schedules in the description uh many of you are in discord so i'll just see you there but thanks a lot to members uh, thanks to active chatters and especially thank you arthur morgan for moderating we got a good group here we got a good group here so we don't have a lot of trouble but i really appreciate your time yes sir Thank you, Chrono, Pavel, Buster, Street Combat, Unknown Noob, our uh, team Baker. Appreciate you, dude. Everybody have a great Friday night. I'll see you in like 14 hours. Buster, it's your first time here. That's cute. That's really cute of you to say. <laughs> anyway, peace, love, burritos, all that good stuff. I'll see you soon.